this is the view from the Seacrest Inn, which is an amazing place to stay in Catalina. So I'm here at the Catalina Island Museum, which is super cool, don't want to give it all away. Um, and this right here, this part of the museum is really cool artifacts from Catalina. So if you go to Catalina Island, you have to check out this museum. There's a casino in Catalina that is very famous and one of the main landmarks but there's not actually any gambling there. This is it. Hotel St. Laurent is the most popular place in Catalina for people to take photos to post to Instagram. It's this pink hotel in these last two photos. This is a cool photo of what it looks like from one of the houses. The houses in Catalina are so beautiful. There are so many good places to eat in Avalon. Avalon is the part of Catalina Island where I was. And this is me in front of some statues by one of my favorite places to eat that is actually called Catalina Coffee and Cookie Company. This photo here is of a house that our tour guide said is the oldest house on all of Catalina Island. We took a bus tour, which I really recommend taking a bus tour. I think it cost about $25, maybe $30. There are more expensive tours that you can take, but I really enjoy taking a bus tour. There are also Hummer tours and other, um, other tours. Now, the, this house that they said is the oldest house, I'm not exactly sure how old it is, but this next picture, this is the Holly Hill house. And this house with the cone-like brownish red roof, it was built between 1888 and 1890. So that other picture I just showed must be even older than that. So there are definitely some really cool old houses on Catalina Island. 